What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. So we got some more exciting news in the world of jailbreaking for iOS 10. So we're going to quickly jump into this, go into Twitter. So this man right here, Adam Donenfeld, has tweeted some very in uh, interesting information earlier today. So I'll read out the two tweets. First up, hashtag Apple fixed eight kernel privilege escalation bugs. I sent them. <laughs> A privilege escalation exploit is already written. It will be released during conferences season in the summer. You may want to save SHSH blobs. So what does this hint at? This hints at a 10.3.1 jailbreak being released in about a month or two. So this is super exciting information. Now, is this Adam Donenfeld guy creditable? Is this information we can believe? Uh, well, yes, I would say so. So if we take a look at his Twitter, uh, he is a security researcher at a company called Zimperium. We can take a look at the Twitter for Zimperium. So the leader in advanced mobile threat defense and mobile security. This is a legit company. And to confirm it even further, let's exit out of uh, Twitter and let's go to Safari. So here we have the security content of iOS 10.3.2. I covered this a couple of days ago and if we scroll down you guys will notice there are the uh, privileges he mentioned within or within his tweet as you guys can see Adam Donenfeld of the Zimperium Z Labs team so this is confirmed a legit source and probably some legit information like I said we can expect more than likely a 10.3.1 jailbreak to be released in hopefully about a month or two uh, if we jump back into Twitter here, let's go back to his tweets. Uh, as you guys can see, uh, a lot of people have probably been asking him a million questions. Uh, the next tweet is indeed 10.3.1, so he confirmed that yes, it will be for 10.3.1. Uh, and then uh, the next tweet after that, it confirms that it will also work on 10.2. So basically, these exploits that he has, Apple has fixed within 10.3.2. So you do not want to be on iOS 10.3.2 at all. If you guys are on 10.3.2, downgrade now back to 10.3.1. Do it immediately. Do not waste any time as you do have a limited amount of time to downgrade uh, while Apple is still signing the firmware within iTunes. I do have a tutorial on how to do the downgrade. The video link for it will be in the description. Now you guys are also going to want to save your SHSH blobs uh, for 10.3.1 as well. And if you guys are on 10.2 or 10.2.1, I would save your blobs for those as well. So now in terms of firmware, should you update, uh, etc.? Well, I am currently still on 10.1.1, jailbroken with my iPhone 7 Plus. If you guys are currently on the same firmware and jailbroken, I would recommend to not uh, update. I'm not going to just because I'm completely happy with this current jailbreak. Also, if you guys are on the 10.2 jailbreak, I would recommend to just stay with that jailbreak. Keep your jailbreak. Don't lose it. If you guys are on 10.2.1, I would recommend to save your blobs for 10.2.1 and then you can go ahead and update to 10.3.1 and also save your blobs for that firmware as well. So save your blobs for 10.2.1 and 10.3.1. Now, if you guys are on 10.3.1, stay there and make sure you save your blobs. I'll leave a tutorial video link in the description on how to save your SHSH blobs as well. And also, if you guys are on 10.3.2, like I said, downgrade now, go back to 10.3.1. That is probably going to be your best bet at a jailbreak at this point. So hopefully I have answered uh, a lot of questions. And this is, like I said, very exciting news for jailbreaking. We basically have almost a confirmation of a jailbreak that will be coming out. Uh, like I said, hopefully in a month, maybe two months we shall see as time goes on. But anyways, uh, if you guys want to stay up to date with the most current jailbreak, make sure you guys click that subscribe button as I will bring you guys update videos periodically letting you know any news that I find out. Uh, but again, like I said, uh, video links for how to downgrade are in the description. Video links on how to save your SH, uh, SH blobs are in the description as well. Hope you guys enjoyed this update. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I will catch you guys in the next one. 
Later.